We have sunshine. Temperatures are in the mid 50s. A little bit of cloud cover passing through right now, but more humidity developing to our south and west will increase our clouds as we head towards tonight. But clouds, that's pretty much it. You can see the bulk of it right now around Etowah County and into northern St. Clair County too. The forecast though, travel weather today looks fine. Out of Birmingham, areas of mid Mississippi or into Atlanta, weather's not going to be an issue in the southern sections of the United States. Temperatures will move into the 40s as we head towards about 7 p.m., but in until then, we're seeing upper 50s, low 60s, 55 degrees. Your temperature now Birmingham, Pell City, we're at 55 in Coleman too. The temperatures are not terribly cold out to our south and west, and that's where our weather will originate. Your future casts will keep us nice and dry for the rest of the day today and into tonight as well, but we will have more cloud cover into this evening that keeps our temperatures from dropping down too low. By 10 p.m. tonight, cloud cover coming up from the south and west. You see showers and storms by Wednesday, 4 o'clock in the afternoon around the tip of the boot there in the Big Easy into Biloxi and Mobile Bay. And then we move into early Thursday morning. So right as we're getting started here, we start to see a lot more rain. I-22, I-20 and I-65 North early Thursday morning, but all rain. We get into Thursday afternoon. That's why Thursday is an impact day. There's 8 a.m. still soaking rain, and then we will continue to have those rain chances all the way into early Friday morning when the cold air arrives. Good news is we have our WVTM 13 live Doppler up and running. This is the only real time radar in its position there in Vance built in the path of the storms because all of this action is coming up from the south and west. So we will get a first hand look, but there are some bumps in the road in your seven day forecast as far as travel goes. But for today, if you're traveling, you should be just fine. Now the rain's going to hold off for most of Wednesday, Wednesday night into 9, 10 p.m. South and Southwest Alabama counties will start to see the rain and notice it started coming in pretty heavy in our West Alabama counties by 3 a.m. So that eight o'clock uh, Monday or Thursday morning rather rush hour may be a little bit difficult. And then the cooler air and the windy weather that's going to impact you on Friday. So Thursday and Friday will be rough. You will see kind of a domino effect. If you're flying out of Birmingham or Atlanta on Thursday, expect delays because of weather. So much uh, rain is expected Saturday, Sunday, though, dry and then more clouds arrive by early next week.